What is going on guys welcome back to the channel and I appreciate you being here today I am back with another Destiny 2 video and today we're going to talk about Iron Banner 6v6 But before we do that people let me remind you that if you do enjoy the video leaving a like truly helps me and my channel out And I do appreciate that support. Okay, so Iron Banner 6v6 started this week for the first time ever in Destiny 2, we got to experience a 6v6 PvP game mode. Now going into this, I wasn't really optimistic. After playing months and months of what in my opinion is a boring 4v4 PvP, I didn't think 6v6 in Destiny 2 would change much. In my opinion, although changes have been made to the feel of PvP in terms of ability and agility changes, spawning time has shortened, heavy ammo dropping increased, and a few other bits and bobs with weapon tuning and so forth, for me, there was still something missing from the standard 4v4 PvP we are used to, and it wasn't just the time to kill. So I jumped on last night to what at the time I thought was only going to be one or two games of Iron Banner, thinking I will get fed up with it after this short amount of time, because this is the amount of time in which I normally get bored of 4v4. That boredom normally relates to lack of reward of playing, to be honest. If there was reward there, I'd probably play more. So I jumped into Iron Banner, and I found myself playing, literally, well, I don't actually even know how many games I played, maybe 15 plus. Well, it was at least for a few hours before my eyes got too tired to keep up. And you guys know what? I enjoyed almost every second of it. Now to me, I won't jump the gun and tell you what I've been seeing and say basically it's just like Destiny 1's PvP because in my opinion that's total BS. Destiny 1's PvP most of the time was so imbalanced it was fun. Destiny 2 is nothing like that in terms of balance. But you know what? It does feel great. I never thought I'd hear myself say that, but PvP actually feels quite decent. I love the addition of 6v6. Now it has its issues which we'll talk about in a second, but let's first talk about the benefits of enjoyment over 4v4. Firstly, there is action around every corner, and I mean every corner. And this adds to the pace of the game. Most of the time on these big maps Destiny 2 offers, within 4v4 you spend most of your time chasing, and once you've located you just end up being team shot. Something I didn't experience at all last night playing 6v6 Iron Banner. For me, I was hesitant because of what I'm used to within 4v4. The constant team shooting, the camping, the hiding, everything we hated about 4v4. I thought this would return bigger and uglier in 6v6. I was wrong. Now, I actually predicted what 6v6 would do for the game months back, saying I believed it would eliminate a lot of the team shooting and so forth. And after playing 6v6 for hours upon end, it seems I was kind of right. I didn't experience much of it at all, definitely not in the sense of a full team running around together. I got more of the understanding of people looking for great solo players, things that we used to see in Destiny 1 over those shitty team shooting players. And this was all night. Also the spawns, not what I expected, they weren't bad. I mean there was the odd time I spawned real close to a battle going on, but nothing which made me scream at my TV as I usually do. Just in general, although it's not exactly like Destiny 1, it does give you the impression on the way Bungie are headed, and in my opinion heading backwards in this sense is the right call. Destiny 2's Iron Banner 6v6 is a fresh new feeling in terms of PvP. It's definitely much better than the standard 4v4, and I hope Bungie do think about making 6v6 a thing of standard, maybe across the board. I loved more or less every second of it and I will be sure to play it later. Okay, so the not so great parts. I mean, hey, some may enjoy this kind of experience, but for me, it kind of reminded me of Mayhem. And Mayhem, although I do love it, needs to be separated from standard PvP. And that was 6v6 on the smaller maps. Jesus, it was hectic. It is honestly real crazy, people. I mean, with everyone rushing, although it can be fun, for me, it's just a little too hectic. I mean, it didn't put me off playing. It was just not at all what I was used to or expecting. I mean, maybe this could be a good thing going forward though. Mixing up maps to change the way games play out isn't necessarily a bad thing. Another thing which in my opinion definitely needs addressing going forward and you feel it so much more in 6v6 and that is the time to kill. Now, the time to kill is one of the most talked about things about Destiny 2's PvP. I don't think there is anyone who thinks it's fine the way it is. Time to kill needs to be shortened. You need to be able to kill people quicker. There is no doubt about it. And like I said, you feel it much more in 6v6 because you come across bigger groups of enemies. A little instance for you. I flanked many times going around the back of certain capture locations to see three or four capturing that point. The problem is, unless there are bots, there's literally no way you can take them all out. Maybe you will kill one or two. Do you get a push? but the remaining players will simply just take you down. And it's instances like this as to why, in my opinion, time to kill definitely needs to be quicker. 
Now we have a great weapon for a quick time to kill in the game and it's called the Vigilance Wing. It honestly feels great. I wouldn't say it's OP either, it feels decent but it's balanced because at a close range you'll get annihilated by the likes of SMGs, shotters, auto rifles and so forth. But at mid range it is unstoppable for sure. It's great to hear Bungie don't plan on nerfing it either, but they do plan on bringing other weapons up to this standard, which is great. Something we're not used to when it comes to Bungie nerfing and buffing certain things. But yeah, definitely a faster time to kill is needed for sure, and we feel it more in 6v6. Another thing I feel needs adjusting is the recovery rate of your health. For me running a hunter, I know we don't have the quickest recovery, but I mean, if I was hurt, it took what felt like minutes to recover my health. And when you've got people hunting you down, it feels even longer, it just makes for slower plays and can sometimes get real irritating, so they definitely need to look into that. One other thing which can be kind of annoying and put people off is solo queuing. This indeed can be a major issue. Playing against stacked teams when you're on your lonesome is one of the most annoying things you can experience in this game's PvP. But how would they incorporate a system to eliminate this? It's beyond me. Something we know they've had complaints about since the beginning of Destiny 1 and still no method to resolve such has been spoke about. I guess it's just one of those things Bungie won't ever address because in reality there's just no simple fix for it. But other than that guys, I mean yeah there are issues here and there but it is just Destiny. I actually really think 6v6 is a much better PvP experience and it is something that needs to stay definitely a step in the right direction in my opinion even if that direction is backwards on that note guys i am out let me know what you think about iron banner did you enjoy 6v6 what issues did you have with it do you prefer 4v4 let me know thanks as always for stopping by people if you enjoyed the video leaving a like really does help me out if you're new around here and enjoy daily destiny videos be sure to subscribe and hit that bell button to never miss a video i upload and hopefully guys i will see you on that next one Get around